it's interesting, but Michael has this history of, of growing up on Vulcan, essentially. And I know you can't talk too many spoilers, but can you give me kind of a rough idea of what that's all about? Yes, well, um, as, as Burnham, Michael Burnham, my parents uh, were killed when I was very young, and so uh, Sarah and Amanda, um, they took me in and uh, became my surrogate parents because the accident that where my parents were killed happened on, um, it, it happened in Vulcan territory. And so um, I come into their home and Sarek, you know, takes me under his wing and I come, I become fully indoctrinated with the Vulcan way of, of life, you know, of seeing the world in this objective, logical way. And it's interesting because obviously there's struggle with that because I am fully human. I am unlike Spock, who is half Vulcan. Um, I am fully human and I am, I have you know, you'll see that there's there's a lot of assimilation that has happened. Um, but what I realize is that my human, my humanity, it doesn't have to be completely um, erased in order for me to embrace everything that I've learned growing up. So it's just it's 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 a very compelling dichotomy that I deal with as Michael because I've got also the star the Starfleet principles that I live by. So I'm a very principled woman. And it's interesting to see how all of those principles clash and then also how they help, and, you know, because um, it's like the, I don't know, hopefully I would become greater than the sum of my parts. And so that's, you're, you're, you're basically seeing me try to, try to do that. <laughs> I, they're wrapping me, but I just asked a real quick question. Would you say she's a soldier? Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, anyone in Starfleet is essentially a soldier. And so, yeah, definitely.